We're thinking of bringing her to a child psychologist. Maybe pretty late. It's 5.30 in the evening and hopefully you guys can see me. But we're on our way to Skylar's first Christmas concert. Anywho, yeah, I stopped vlogging so I completely failed to vlogmas. The last time I vlogged was day 11 and after that I just stopped because I just have so much to do for before we leave. I managed to pack the kids' clothes. Just have to pack ours more things here and there to do around the house oh yeah I cut my hair you guys if you guys follow me on snapchat you already know that but I got it lightened again and I see, I, um, I, I see a star up there do yeah there is a big star up there I really liked my hair when I cut it short the last time I think it was like July back in July so I wanted to cut it the same length again and just lighten up the color a bit and I got my nails done, so it's Disneyland ready. Hopefully you guys can see that, because it's dark. Skylar is having a meltdown. <laughs> Who knows if she's gonna participate. Oh my god. Yummy. Oh my goodness, this girl has stage fright. We're all getting dressed for the costumes. Hey guys, so we got home a bit ago from Skylar's Christmas concert and oh my gosh, that was a total fail. She just had a really bad stage fright and it's not the first time this has happened. Um, it's happened before, like I expected it to happen kind of, but I didn't want it to happen because she was so pumped for it. Like in the morning talked about it and after school talked about it she was so excited and then the minute we got out of the car to go inside she just froze and she just wanted Chris to pick her up and carry her in there and since then she just had her eyes closed and I tried really hard to get her to participate but it was just embarrassing for our part because she was crying so hard. So anyway, that was that. Um, they were so cute though. And the funny thing is her part, she was a Christmas tree and all she had to do was stand there, but she still didn't want to participate and it's, it's the people. If you guys have been following us for a few years now, you guys know that uh, Skylar tends to be really shy. It actually depends on the days. Some days she's outgoing and she's like ready to rock and roll. Other days she's just not having it. And this was one of the days and it's probably my fault because I had wanted her to take a nap after I picked her up from school, but she didn't get around to taking a nap. So. I don't know. It just makes me so sad. I just wish she did something. Well, you can't make her do something she doesn't want to do. I know, I know. You can't make her do something she doesn't want to do, but... It's not going to make it any better. Yeah. <clears throat> I was just embarrassed, that's all. Uh, 
so I hope that. <sighs> well, what happens if you find out that? <clears throat> what happens if? What happens if she, you know, has like a real problem that we need to address? Are you getting embarrassed with that? No. Okay. Yeah, well, well Chris and I were talking about. Well, then don't feel embarrassed. But oh, she was crying so loud. Just being a brat because she's crying because she doesn't want to do something. That's one thing, but she's pretty much had this since she's born. Mm -hmm. Chris and I were talking on the way home about if she doesn't get better, then we're thinking of bringing her to. A child psychologist maybe it could be anxiety she's always had this like shy nature you guys know that but it's weird because on our vlog she's like so like always wanted to be on camera and everything uh, but I guess just performing like wise um, stage fright it is what it is and We'll have to figure it out. And she's only in preschool, so um, this is also one of the reasons why we put her in preschool is to get used to, you know, people and yeah, just to be social and just to have that to look forward to and to have the structure. Well, that's one of the reasons why. But anyway, Chris put her to bed because the whole time she was having her meltdown before her Christmas concert, um, she kept saying she was tired. So oh, except for when I tried to put her to bed now, suddenly she's not tired. Oh, there you go. So I put her to bed anyway. Yeah, so Chris put her to bed, read her a story, and she's up there crying, but you know what? When she says she's tired, she's tired. So now she's suddenly not tired that she's, she's in bed. But anyway, that's all. I just wanted to basically let you guys know how I felt because, I don't know, I guess as moms have these expectations and... That, you know, for her to sing in a Christmas singing mm -hmm. concert is a reasonable expectation. Yeah. Yes, I, don't know. I, don't know. I even, like, was desperate enough to just tell her, like, okay, you don't have to sing. All you have to do is stand there with your friends. That's it. <laughs> but no, she wasn't having it. So yeah, I guess just like my expectation got the best of me and I was just, uh, I got a bit embarrassed, but what do you do? It happens. My parents came, Chris's dad came. Anyway, as we were walking into the door, I slipped and fell on ice and I was holding Kai so my knee is throbbing really bad, and so is my thigh. It's throbbing really bad right now. Did you save the baby? But I did save Kai, because that's the reason why I would rather have me get hurt than have him bail on concrete with his head first. So I'd rather have that. So yeah, I'm probably going to go ice my leg, and then I'll just import this vlog. Um... And I have to pack. That's the major thing I have to pack. So, yeah, you want me to read your book? Anyway, I'm gonna end the vlog now, you guys. Sorry, it's another short one. But Skylar didn't do anything. If you other moms have had that issue with your kids, all oh, the things, babe. It's right here. It hurts. Thank you. <laughs> So Chris just went and got an ice pack for me to put on my leg. But anyway, I don't know like any other moms out there that's had this problem with your kid being super shy. What did you guys do? Did it get better? Give me some input or advice would be helpful. Okay, bye guys. Say bye bye. <laughs> Mama's gotta pack your clothes. <laughs> okay, bye guys. I know how to go.